histology of medium sized artery or muscular artery histologically there are five main blood vessels they are artery arteriole capillaries venules and veins all these blood vessels have basically the same structures each one has three cones or tunics namely tunica adventitia tunica media and tunica intima tunica adventitia it is the outermost layer which is made up of loose connective tissue and contains vasa vasorum and unmyelinated sympathetic fibers that is nervi vasorum it also contains more elastic fibers and less collagen fibers and external elastic lamina which demarcates the tunica adventitia and tunica media <coughs> tunica media it is a middle layer which is made up of smooth muscle fibers and elastic fibers in the medium sized artery or muscular artery the tunica media contains more smooth muscle fibers and less elastic fibers hence the name muscular artery tunica intima it is a innermost layer which is made up of endothelium and internal elastic lamina the endothelium is nothing but the simple squamous epithelium lining the lumen of the blood vessels difference between large or elastic artery and medium or muscular artery in large or elastic artery in the tunica intima the internal elastic lamina is poorly defined whereas in medium sized artery the internal elastic lamina is well defined presence of sub endothelial connective tissue in large or elastic artery absence of sub endothelium in medium sized or muscular artery in large sized or elastic artery the tunica media is mainly made up of elastic fibers with muscle fibers hence the name elastic artery in medium sized artery the tunica media mainly contains smooth muscle fibers with less elastic fibers and hence the name muscular artery large or elastic sized artery example aorta medium sized or muscular artery example radial artery brachial artery femoral artery thank you